we're going to install the Mudskipper 9 horsepower and 16 horsepower electric start control box without the safety kill switch. Uh, first of all, we've loosened, pre-loosened these bolts up just to make things a little quicker on the video. So you're going to want to take these two bolts immediately right out of the engine and then the nut on the back here. Um, just take that off as well for now and that's the start. So we just reinstalled the two screws on the top and the bottom of the control box. Just finger tighten them. They're 10 millimeter. Uh, and then we can just use a, a ratchet here to tighten them up a little bit, just so they're snug. No need to over tighten them. That'll hold on there nicely. And find this uh, pre-attached black wire here and just disconnect those two. And then midway down the top portion, it's a little black clip here. We are just going to press this clip up into that hole on the back of the electric start and that holds that wire uh, in place nicely. Coming out of the bottom of the electric start control box there are five wires. There is a black male, there is a black spade adapter, there is a black circle, there is a brown male, and then there's this black with a green clip. To the top of the wire we just snapped into place we are going to attach the black male. The bottom wire that we disconnected uh, is going to attach into the green connector, like so. The ring on the back is going to go to the back of the solenoid here, and then we are just going to um, attach that nut back onto the back of the solenoid, and then we can tighten that down at a later time. The spade adapter goes onto the spade terminal on the back of the solenoid like that and then lastly the brown wire attaches into the female red wire like so and then lastly we'll just tighten up the nut on the back of the solenoid and that installation is complete again without the safety kill switch